Human trafficking and forced child labour, these are global problems. Children are made to work under extreme conditions wherever they're told to go. In gold mines, or on cocoa plantations, or in the fishing industry. Some of these children are as young as five years old. Les enfants, ils sont fragiles. Les enfants, il faut les protéger parce que la Convention des Nations Unies relative aux droits des enfants les protège normalement. Et ça, nous devons nous appuyer dessus. Nous devons travailler dans ce sens pour que l'enfant retrouve vraiment toute sa quiétude, tous ses droits fondamentaux doivent être respectés partout où il se trouve. Quand on voit des enfants qui sont impliqués dans la construction donc de maisons traditionnelles, quand on voit des enfants qui sont impliqués dans la fabrication de boissons frélatées, des enfants impliqués dans la production de charbon, mais c'est des choses qui sont inacceptables. Et cette opération nous a permis donc de voir qu'il y a encore d'autres formes de phénomènes auxquels il va falloir que nous nous attaquions. And those children's human rights are gone because they're controlled. Totally. They are totally dependent on the person who has brought them there. Then they become totally dependent on the person who makes them do the work. And then they become totally dependent even on themselves for just basic survival. It is only through partnerships that we can tackle this form of modern day slavery. No one country or organization can address these problems alone. By combining our resources, combining our strengths, combining our will, we can work together to save innocent victims from losing their childhood. This was why in June 2015, Interpol launched Project Acoma to unite efforts across West Africa to combat child labor. Je pense que c'est un projet novateur, novateur dans le sens de la collaboration inédite entre Interpol et OIM et même avec les partenaires gouvernementaux, et les ONG, etc. Donc je pense que cette approche euh, holistique, cette approche intégrée là, donnera les résultats euh, escomptés. It was through this united effort involving the government, health workers, the IOM and law enforcement that 48 children were rescued and 22 people arrested, sending a strong message to the traffickers. But if you traffic these children in, there will be a police response. And from that you get prevention, and from that you get protection, and from that you can see very clear partnership. How can you play a role in helping to stop child labour? How can you help protect the next generation? If we are going to make a change, we need to start with the children, and we need to start now, because in just a few years, they won't be children anymore.